Our nation's firefighters, first responders, and military personnel are being injured. And they're being injured due to no fault of their own, but rather from exposure to chemicals contained in firefighting foams. Firefighting foams and the protective gear that firefighters wear contains PFAS chemicals, which are known to cause a whole host of injuries. And it's not just our firefighters. Individuals that live near fire stations, near civilian airports, and near military bases where firefighting foams have been used for years may be exposed through PFAS in their drinking water. PFAS in drinking water has been known to cause a number of health issues. And so cities, states, and water utilities are also being harmed due to the expense and the cost of removing PFAS from drinking water. Here at Beasley Allen, we represent individuals who've been harmed from exposure to PFAS chemicals in AFFF firefighting foams and other sources. We also represent cities and water utilities who have been harmed and have to pay the cost of removing PFAS chemicals from drinking water. If you or anyone you know have questions about PFAS or about a case, please reach out to me, David Diab, or anyone here at Beasley Allen.